The story of the J-20 Mighty Dragon begins not just with an aircraft, but with a question that echoes through the corridors of modern military power, can China truly build a stealth fighter capable of rivaling America's F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II? Since its first public appearance in 2011, the Chengdu J-20 has captured global attention as China's first operational fifth-generation fighter jet. But beneath its sleek, angular design lies a mystery that continues to fuel debates among defense analysts and aviation experts worldwide. Does the J-20 truly live up to its promise of being undetectable, a shadow that glides unseen across the radar spectrum? To answer that question, we must journey deep into the heart of stealth technology, the science of invisibility that has reshaped air warfare for decades. Stealth is not magic, it is engineering at the highest level, a dance between physics, materials, and design precision so refined that even the slightest imperfection can betray a jet's position in the sky. And in that silent war of detection and deception, the J-20 story becomes one of both ambition and uncertainty. To understand the essence of the J-20's stealth capability, one must first look at its shape. Every curve, every contour is crafted with purpose. The aircraft's angular lines, canted tail fins, and blended fuselage are not merely aesthetic, they are a statement of intent. Radar waves, when they strike these surfaces, are deflected away rather than reflected back toward their source, making the aircraft far less visible to radar systems. The J-20's airframe borrows heavily from principles pioneered by the American F-22, with diamond-shaped wings and serrated engine nozzles designed to minimize radar cross-section. But while the West has had decades of experience perfecting stealth technology, from the F-117 Nighthawk to the B-2 Spirit and beyond, China's mastery in this field is relatively new. Reports suggest that the J-20 uses radar-absorbent materials, or RAM coatings, designed to absorb electromagnetic waves. However, without direct access to classified performance data, analysts can only speculate on how effective these materials truly are compared to those used by its American counterparts. Still, it is undeniable that China has made remarkable progress, narrowing the technological gap faster than anyone anticipated. The engines, however, tell a more complex story. For years, the J-20 relied on imported Russian AL-31F engines, powerful but not optimized for stealth operations. Their circular nozzles produce a radar and infrared signature larger than desired, a critical vulnerability in an aircraft designed to vanish from detection. China has since been developing its own indigenous WS-10 and WS-15 engines, said to feature serrated edges and advanced cooling systems to reduce infrared emissions. If successful, these upgrades could elevate the J-20's stealth profile to levels comparable with the F-22 and F-35. Yet, the challenge remains immense. Stealth is not only about deflecting radar but also about minimizing heat, sound, and electromagnetic emissions. Every engine component, every exhaust plume, and every electronic signal contributes to the aircraft's visibility in the eyes of modern detection systems. And with advancements in low-frequency radar technology, even the most stealthy aircraft can no longer guarantee complete invisibility. What was once undetectable is now simply harder to detect a crucial distinction in the age of digital warfare. Beyond its physical design, the J-20's stealth performance is also influenced by its combat doctrine and mission profile. Unlike the F-22, which was built primarily for air superiority and first strike dominance, the J-20's operational philosophy appears to emphasize long-range interception, reconnaissance, and anti-access missions. Its elongated nose and large internal base suggest a focus on carrying long-range missiles such as the PL-15 a weapon rumored to have an active radar seeker capable of engaging targets beyond 200 kilometers. In essence, the J-20 may not be designed to infiltrate enemy airspace undetected like a stealth bomber, but rather to project power at distance, striking from beyond the range of enemy defenses. This approach reflects China's broader military strategy, deterrence through reach, control through visibility. The J-20 does not need to be perfectly invisible if it can strike first and retreat before retaliation. In that sense, its stealth serves as a multiplier of its range and lethality rather than an absolute shield of invisibility. Still, questions remain about the J-20's actual radar cross-section, or RCS, the metric that determines how visible an object is to radar. Western analysts estimate that the J-20's RCS might be comparable to older stealth designs such as the F-117 or early F-35 prototypes, but not as low as the F-22's benchmark levels. 
Part of this stems from design compromises, the canards, for instance, which enhance maneuverability, also tend to increase radar reflectivity. In theory, this trade-off reduces stealth efficiency in exchange for agility, suggesting that the J-20's designers prioritized versatility over absolute invisibility. On the other hand, the aircraft's large internal weapons bays and smoothly contoured surfaces indicate serious effort to minimize external drag and radar reflections. China's use of advanced computational fluid dynamics and radar modeling software has certainly improved design precision. Whether the J-20 can maintain true low observability across multiple radar bands, particularly against advanced Western systems like the in apg 81 or European ESA radars, remains uncertain. What is clear, however, is that the J-20 represents a monumental step forward in China's ability to design, produce, and operationalize advanced stealth fighters on par with the world's best. Then comes the psychological dimension of stealth perception as a weapon. In modern warfare, what your enemy believes can be as powerful as what you can actually do. The J-20's public displays, its carefully curated airshow appearances, and the secrecy surrounding its specifications have built an aura of mystery that amplifies its strategic impact. Nations in the Asia-Pacific region, from Japan to India, must now factor the J-20 into their defense calculations, regardless of whether it is truly invisible to radar. This psychological pressure alone alters the balance of deterrence. The mere existence of the J-20 forces adversaries to invest in costly counter-stealth systems, radar networks, and interception capabilities. In this sense, the J-20 stealth technology may already be achieving its purpose not through complete invisibility, but through the illusion of invisibility. For China, that illusion is almost as valuable as the real thing. As technology continues to evolve, the question shifts from whether the J-20 is completely undetectable to whether it is stealthy enough. In modern air combat, perfection is unnecessary, what matters is who detects whom first, who locks on first, and who fires first. The J-20 stealth technology, combined with its range, sensors, and missile systems, gives China a formidable advantage in the first moments of an engagement. However, radar technology is advancing just as rapidly. Quantum radar, passive detection networks, and AI-assisted signal analysis may soon render even the most advanced stealth jets visible once again. When that day comes, stealth will no longer be about invisibility, but about survivability, the ability to fight and win in a contested electromagnetic environment. The J-20, with its fusion of old design philosophies and new technological frontiers, stands at the crossroads of that transformation. In the end, whether the J-20 Mighty Dragon is truly invisible to radar may not be the most important question. What truly matters is what it represents, a symbol of China's determination to challenge Western air superiority and redefine the future of aerial warfare. The Mighty Dragon is not just a fighter, it is a message, a manifestation of ambition and national pride wrapped in layers of radar-absorbent materials. It reminds the world that stealth is as much about perception as it is about physics. So, is the J-20 truly undetectable, or is it simply stealthy enough to change the rules of the game? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below, and remember, in the silent skies of the modern battlefield, sometimes the greatest power lies not in being unseen, but in being feared.